Candidate elimination algorithm. To understand this algorithm, an example is solved before we discuss about the algorithm. For our simple understanding. Candidate elimination algorithm computes the version space containing all hypotheses. So candidate elimination algorithm finds all describable hypotheses that are consistent with the observed training example. So we need to understand that candidate elimination algorithm accepts only consistent hypotheses from the training example. So it looks for the consistent hypothesis. There are two terms that is used here that is consistent and satisfy. Target concept is enjoy sport that is yes or no. An example x is said to satisfy hypothesis h when h of x equals 1 regardless whether x is positive or negative. That means h of x equals 1 whether it is x is positive or negative. And the consistent with h depends on the target concept and it is particularly h of x equals c of x and h of x can be yes. So this s represents the target concept that is enjoy sports yes or no. So satisfy represents h of x equals 1 regardless it is positive or negative. Consistence represents h of x equals h of x equals c of x that is equal to yes. That means satisfies the target concept. Now solving the candidate elimination algorithm initialize g boundary set contain most general hypothesis in h. So there is G boundary that G represents the all possible generic hypothesis. That means it accepts all hypothesis. And yes not represents the initial initialize the boundary set to contain the most specific value. So S not contains the specific values. G contains more generic values. Now our term is that S0 at the top and G0 at the bottom and the aim is the aim what we do is we start solving S0 and reach towards generic and from G0 we start from generic and we reach towards specific that is the whole concept of candidate elimination algorithm. Now consider an example. So these are the six attributes and the aim of it, the target concept is enjoy sport. Enjoy sports, yes or no. There are six attributes that is sunny, warm, normal, strong, warm and same in the first instance. So there are totally four instance and each instance having the hypothesis with the attributes that is been given. And the attributes is positive if it is yes and negative if it is no. So these are the target concept. So let us use this example to solve candidate elimination algorithm. Now S0 is more specific and the first example that is sunny, first example that is taken from the problem we discussed previous slide that is the first one is sunny, warm, normal, strong, warm, same and yes. So here the first training example is taken and S0 is more specific. This is more specific. So we need to generalize this. So it is made more general. So and to get S1. So S0 is moved to S1. And the generic which is we have seen it all also it is all question mark which is accept any value and these values is easily accepted so it remains the same. So G1 G naught reaches to G1 and there is no change but S0 is changed to S1. So this is S0 and this is S1. 
so we take all these attribute values and we take it as s1 and now the second one second example that is the second instance and that is sunny warm high strong warm same and yes and this is s1 and this is the s1 we have taken this is the second example sunny warm high strong warm same and yes this is the second training example is presented and the training concept is positive that is yes s1 is more than the reason is because s1 do not cover this so it is more little bit generalized so s1 is more generalized so s1 to s2 g1 is generalized which covers all the values so there is no change so but g1 to g2 so s1 to s2 is written here s1 is sunny warm normal strong warm same and this is it is positive when it is normal and it is positive when it is high so these two are except any value so this is question mark and the s2 is more generic so this is specific to little bit more generic and this is what happens so s0 is specific and it is made little generic and then it is made little generic and the generic value except all these values there is no problem so now we take the third example that is the third instance and this instance is negative the target concept is the enjoy sports is negative so there is rainy cold high strong warm and change so this example is taken and s2 is the given we have solved and the third training example is taken and the tar target concept is no and the third example is negative for example g of the version space s is more dental that predicts incorrectly as positive hence g2 is made more specific that means g2 is all question mark that is accepts any value if it accepts any value but in the case 3 it is no so this is incorrect so it is saying it is positive but it is no so it is incorrect so it is more generic we need to make it little bit specific so g2 is made specific to g3 but s yes, is remains the same so g2 is made to g3 so g2 is all it accepts any values so it is made to g3 because it is no now this is the new value new g3 that is formed now let us look at how this g3 is formed now initially s0 is all specific and then s0 to s1 then s1 to s3 then the s3 and s2 remains the same if it is no take the previous value see if the new third example has arrived that is as a third example that is s3 uh, this remains the same because it is no so that is the condition if it is no take the previous value so s2 is remains the same as s3 but the generic term g2 is all except any value this is not acceptable because the condition is no so it cannot be positive when the third example is negative so we need to make this generic value to little bit specific that gives g3 and the g3 obtained is this now why is the three hypothesis that we have taken that is sunny warm sunny any value warm any value any value same is because these are the previous s2 we are getting g3 from obtained from s3 so this is s3 and that is sunny and any value sunny and value warm and any value and same and any value so this is this is the reason why we are taking this this is same and change and sunny and rainy 
warm and cold there there are difference here this is the difference this is the difference so this becomes more generic that is the reason we take these values to make it g3 generic so g2 is generic and g3 is little bit specific from generic to little bit specific but it represents the generic values so sunny all values uh, any values all any values and then any values with warm any values with same so this is the third example since third example is negative g2 is more general and or positive it is made specific to get g3 note in this case h hypothesis can be question mark question mark normal and question mark with all any value so this correctly labels negative so this we have not taken is because the previous s1 and s2 are positive so when s1 and s2 are positive we are not taking this so this will this is this becomes inconsistent so we are avoiding this and next the last example last instance is is the positive the target concept is positive that is the fourth one so it is sunny warm high strong cool and change in this case in this case the it that is s3 is formed s3 to s4 we get this covers more specific now here this is change and this is same so and this is positive same change and positive so it can accept any value so this is made little bit generic from this specific to more generic so that is s4 s4 sunny warm any value strong any value any value this any value is obtained from change and same so it it is yes it is positive if it is change if it is it is positive if it is same so these two becomes generic so this results from s3 to s4 this is the value that we have got now g3 is sunny any value warm any value any value and same now in this case it is no more the same it is generic so this specific value become generic here at this point so now the generic value is it, it can it takes this generic value g3 takes this generic value so g3 gets g4 and that eliminating the last condition that is same so the two hypothesis is obtained at g4 so that is g4 is sunny any value warm any value and the total representation of this is as shown here it has three hypothesis and all possible values if it is it can it accepts sunny and strong and any value it accepts sunny warm and any value it have to accept any value warm and strong and any value so these are the three hypotheses that is obtained from s4 and g4 this is the final version space for enjoy sports s4 is sunny warm any value strong any value any value and this is g4 sunny any values warm any values and these are the possibilities that there of the hypothesis that can be that can occur with this training examples thank you